When you're looking for a Christian school in Chicago, it's pretty difficult to find anything, especially that matches CHA. It's just not possible. I did my research and probably toured almost every school in the city of Chicago and ended up feeling frustrated, like there was something I was looking for and it, quite frankly, didn't exist. Christian Heritage Academy is incredible. It's just a, it's an incredible place. There's amazing things happening. We finally went to take a tour of the public school, uh, which we were still really considering because we felt like it was important to be in our neighborhood. And after doing so and going to observe a kindergarten classroom, mind you, one of the best in the city that had 30 plus kids, one teacher and no aides, it felt like an overwhelming circumstance to bring our five-year-old daughter into. She was in a classroom size of 28, and I remember her coming home and telling me that she was really sad that she didn't talk to her teacher that day. And she loved her teacher, her teacher was very nice, but she just didn't get the attention that she needed. It kind of came to, down to the fact that she just felt like she was not known, and she felt very small. When we came to CHA and toured through the classes and saw anywhere from 12 to 15 or 16 kids in a classroom, the amount of time that each of them got to spend with the teacher, the personalities of the teacher and how that really just impacted their viewpoint on their job, the fact that it wasn't just a job, that they showed up at it every day, but it was a calling and it meant something more to them. There's just no words for how much comfort it gives you as a parent to know that you're sending your kid out the door each day into the arms of these people who care so much about them. At CHA, we saw a huge improvement in just her self-confidence and the small classroom size um, really helped her getting to know her teacher and her teacher knowing her and her feeling like she's known and cared for, I think has made a huge difference for her. And at the end of the day, there was no way we could really, after seeing those two side by side, think that we could just go down the road of the public school we wanted to be at CHA. We are focused on growing the whole child, so it, that includes cognitive growth, but it's also physical, social, emotional, and spiritual. Integrating faith and learning really is about, first of all, teachers knowing what they believe and partnering with parents on what they believe, and then bringing to the children according to the developmental level of the child, what is the best way to um, help them to see um, that everything emanates from God's Word, from Jesus. Amen. People say all the time to me, how often do you, you know, talk about biblical concepts? How often do you um, teach the children faith? And I'll say 24-7, all the time. We want to make everything integrated. We don't want what we're learning about God just to be at Bible time. We want them to see it through what we're doing in academics, what we're doing socially, integrated all the way through. For me, I look at the money that I pay to send my kids to a Christian school as an investment. And if I look at it as an investment in my child's life with the ultimate goal of training them up to follow Jesus, there's no better investment I can make. The unique thing about CHA is that you're not compromising your education for your kids by being in a faith-based school. As children are learning above and beyond state standards of education, they're also given the worldview through which to see God and to see Christ through everything. If students are going to grow up to be who Christ calls them to be, they need to be so good at what they do that we want to really make sure we're offering excellence in education, academic skills, um, helping them to know who they are and who God means them to be. It's just amazing how you get a top-notch education and it's faith-grounded and you just feel at home. Everybody makes you feel so welcome. It's nothing like a school experience I've experienced before. 
the unique thing about CHA Chicago that's different from any other school is that we are really a partnership with parents. Parents don't realize that once children um, start into full day programs, kindergarten, elementary, um, the children are in essence spending more time away from home than they are um, with parents. Teachers, as the children are learning, are clicking away at the photos. Photos can really show the parents not only what the kids are learning, but as the teachers intentionally talk about what's happening and telling those stories about the day, parents really get a good sense of um, what the children are learning, why they're learning it, and the wonderful relationship that the children are having with their teachers at school. CHA is committed to the holistic growth of the child, which means that we're growing the child inside the classroom, but also in the fine arts activities outside the classroom, such as music and art, and this year we're offering Spanish club. So with the play-based curriculum, they are starting to develop this internal motivation to learn. It's, it's learning, it's discovering, it's trying different things, and it's... Um, it's experimenting. For early childhood, for preschool, kindergarten, it's really important that children are learning through a play-based model, that they are hands-on, they're learning to inquire about the world, they're learning how to solve problems. We know kids need to uh, run, jump, play, turn sideways. They need to have a lot of cross-brain, cross-lateralization um, movement, which really helps the neural pathways in their brains in order to make those um, ways that they can learn later on. To me as an educator, it doesn't matter how old you are, how young you are. What matters is what's going to be that key that unlocks a child's uh, brain that says, ah, I can do this. We looked at Christian schools, we looked at non-Christian schools. I think our biggest concern as we considered a faith-based education was that we did not want to be creating this alternate universe where our kids were functioning, where everything was Christian. One of the things we love about CHA is they will be very forthright in telling you um, that they do not want to be a bubble. Their desire is to say, you know, here's the world, here's what our faith says, how do we reconcile these two things? And it doesn't look the same for everybody. One of the things we love about CHA is being able to be a part of this chapter of its development. This is a brand new school that is changing the educational landscape in Chicago. It is bringing something to Chicago that is new and that has not been here before. You can always debate academics and who's the best. You can always debate who has better facilities. But at the end of the day, I still go back to my number one priority, which is ultimately that I know that my kids, when they go into a, this classroom, are being trained to look at the world through the lens of Jesus Christ. And that's something that we have that no one else does.